take the run and be satisfied with the run. I don't know where the crowd's coming onto the field. They think the match is over. There's no question that it isn't. There's a, a real invasion of the ground here now. And they've snatched the stumps out of the ground. They've gone away with them. There's a lad who's got one moving across towards the boundary. There's another one who snatched a, a stump. And this is absolute chaos here. The security forces were not prepared for this in any way. No stumps done at this end. Two have been retrieved and I think they've got all three now. Return comes to the bowler's end and he drops it. Steve Waugh needs to hit it for at least four. Keith Arthurton needs to pin him down for less than that. Everything hinges on this. The series is level at two all. In the air, he doesn't get it. They've gone for one, they'll come for two. There's an invasion and the return comes in. Madness here at border. Absolute chaos. Someone's going to get injured out there. They're harassing the players. This is dangerous now for the players in the middle. Somebody snatched a bat. The police are out there surrounding Steve Waugh. He's been jostled and pushed. He's in the middle. Merv Dillon is out there with him. This is absolute chaos. It has happened over and over and over here in the Caribbean. Nothing has been done about it, and it's happened here again. One of these days, a player is going to get seriously injured in the melee. In the meantime, the West Indies have won an extraordinary match by one run. Four runs needed off the last ball, but who is to say what the match referee, Raman Sabaro, will determine this time. Well, we've decided now that the match has been tied. The, uh, the two sides have tied the match, and therefore they'll go to Barbados on Saturday and Sunday, uh, all, all square. The last delivery was, was pulled away to, into the mid-wicket area. Uh, not desperately quickly and they ran uh, one and then they turned and ran the second one uh, a third really would have been very difficult but as you can see Steve is fighting his way uh, down the wicket to get the third with all those um, people around him the situation had become really quite quite impossible and the other thing of course Raman is that Keith Arthur went to take the stumps out of the ground but there was no stumps there they were already out of the ground and well on their way to somewhere in Georgetown <laughs> they'd already disappeared at the, the speed of light the uh, the captains and the managers on both sides they all shook hands and said you know well done well played I mean they know what a circus it was at the at the finish and I don't think anybody really wants to win a game like that I don't think there are many West Indians who would want to win a game under those circumstances.